hello 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 cancer cancer energies welcome back to my channel this is lemon here with another reading by luminescent i'm using a folk deck and grandma baby's black lenormand deck black gold lenormand deck so we are getting the message from mercury and saturn for the energy of cancer regarding responsibility accountability and discipline um this message is for cancer energy anywhere in your chart it may or may not resonate for you as a sun sign moon or rising sign cancer however we all have cancer in our chart so if it doesn't apply let it fly and thank you for stopping by i think i'm gonna use that every video <laughs> all right so um mercury what message do we have for cancer regarding the past six of pentacles six of discs Okay, Mercury, what message do we have for cancer regarding the present moment and discipline, accountability, responsibility? Got your energy here in the present, four of cups. Okay, and Mercury, um, present, I mean, future message for responsibility, accountability, and discipline. What's the future message for cancer? Future message for cancer, please. Need one card for the future message for cancer regarding discipline and accountability we got the six of swords so we got two sixes okay okay at the bottom we got the nine everybody get nines so we got the nine of cups jupiter and pisces so um this transit just ended but it's going to return so during this transit this short transit in the 12 13 year ago transit um, there was a sense of um, happiness, completion, emotionally, being fulfilled. You had high hopes, high optimism about all of your dreams coming true. So in the past, makes sense why we have the six of disc here, which says um, success. So you probably envisioned your success with this moon in Taurus card because you highly valued the things that you were intuitively guided to do, being that the moon is your you know your ruling star associated whatever you know however you want to put it um you are having a better understanding or you've had the better understanding during those times where values and value valuables and resources especially within yourself is way more important than the physical it's way more important and um mercury or the message here for you for responsibility, accountability, discipline is that you need to be more disciplined with how you feel about your own personal value and resources that you have for yourself, your body most definitely, than the physical material wealth that you can acquire. Okay, that's where your the depths of your sorry, cancer. That's where the depths of your um <coughs> Your wealth is really going to stem from right now because another moon card, we have the moon in Cancer. This is your, you know, home energy. So in the past, you, you know, were very much able to manifest the things that you wanted. But now you need to take a look at what are you valuing emotionally and what and how is it affecting you emotionally as well that has an impact on what your intuition is trying to get you to understand and follow and you want to listen to it because having a deep connection with your intuition is one of luxury it is a luxury because a lot of people are out here choosing to be disconnected from their intuitive guidance their ancestors their spiritual guides angel guides and they're choosing not to believe that they're choosing to think it's all a bunch of bullshit some bullshit <laughs> kelly some bull they think it's some bull okay and you know better and you know it's a luxury to always be connected and if your intuition is telling you you need to stop doing something stop doing it if your intuition tell you, you need to go in this direction move in that direction right now um you have this new moon in leo in your energy prior to in the energy following yours so definitely values and wealth is a big one right here but in the future we have the mercury in aquarius science car you're going to start to connect the dots figure it out and get moving into a more peaceful a peacefully like peaceful emotions 
you you can you can you will understand the luxury of what the ups and downs are have been meaning for you as of lately with this transit peaking in and coming back out the end of the year most definitely you will see with this jupiter transit um how you can expand on the science of it all the science of how you can get back to this nine of cups energy that you had in the past and bring it into your present and make it your future um, but it does require you studying and learning more about yourself your uniqueness and disconnecting from the emotional baggages and emotional thoughts of other people because we are all unique in our own right and if you are carrying and doing the emotional work for somebody else or they putting their emotional work on you you're not living in luxury that's not it's not it's not a luxury to be responsible for other people's emotions it's not a luxury for someone to be responsible for your emotions you have to own that and live with that and understand how to balance that on your own and then and it does come down to a science on how you do that and you know everyone has to learn how to do that you know what i'm saying that's why we have cancer in our chart to teach us you know how to understand our intuition how to receive the messages how to you know get it and boom we have the key okay the key the key to the kingdom we have 32 no it's not 32 it says 32 oh it's 33 i'm gonna say it is this an eye over here Maybe it's a misprint. I don't know. It looks like 32. But it's 33. Okay. Master number of nurturing, caring, family, being determined, making good judgment. Um, we are in the sixth dimension. We're ascending. Things are speeding up as they slow down. You know what I'm saying? With Saturn being in Aquarius, you get to slowly see the experiments on your spirits that's being done. Oop and you can do something about it or you can allow other people's emotions to get the better of you okay solutions eight of diamonds earth energy key is black spiritual legacy uh disclosure this is black gold lenormand but it applies to everybody because we all black okay black means everybody okay everybody got whatever so key is black spiritual legacy key is ceremony and resilience it is in our drums in our movement it is in the stories we tell and the traditions that have survived a relentless cultural genocide another uh disclosure this does specifically apply to those who feel it the most it is the language of our ancestors it is our generational gifts key reminds us that even when we don't think we know we be knowing we aren't new to this but true to this got it down to a science the answers are in our blood coded into our dna it is only a matter of remembering of tapping into our magic this card says the answers you're seeking now are already inside of you that's the luxury cancer you got the key baby and the key is tune in tune in tune in okay all right that's you guys' reading from mercury and saturn thank you so much for tuning in and see you next week trying to find the significance of what you mean breaking through glass cages inside of me surfing and swimming in a never-ending